In this video, we'll add a part of a workflow to a container in Altrix. At this point, we've completed data cleansing of the asset list. Let's take one more step to keep our work organized. We'll use a container to separate these data cleansing steps into a distinct piece of our workflow. Add the entire existing workflow to a container by doing the following. Click just before the input data tool and drag your cursor across all the tools that we have used so far to highlight them. Right click on any of the tools and select add to new container from the list. In the configuration pane, rename the caption asset list data cleansing. We can see that the title of the container has changed to Asset List Data Cleansing. Good job! You have completed the steps to transform your asset list so that the data can be used to compute depreciation for each of the assets. In a future video, you will learn how to copy this container and reconfigure the tools in the workflow. In the next video, you will learn how to separate tangible personal property from real property.